What up, family? It caused nothing to hit that like button, fam. The homie Big Boogie. We know situations. Big Boogie really been in the news with it, fam. Her lately. The situation with 1017 OT upset. It's been a few ops, fam, that have been coming to surface and kind of jumping on Big Boogie top. Now, if you don't remember, Big Boogie and his homies, fam, you know, they responded to a lot of allegations about them. And in this live, Big Boogie and his people was pretty much saying that they'll body something, fam. Anybody pull up on him playing, that's what it's going to be. Now, after that live went about, things kind of got quiet, fam, between the rappers, the two groups. Because we know a lot of uh, the mob ties, J Prince type situation was overshadowing a lot of unbelief beef that was still brewing, right? Now, we know that when it comes to Big Boogie, he's not just a rapper. Big Boogie is an entertainer also. You feel me? And, you know, I salute that about Big Boogie all the time because entertainment is well needed, you know, in the hip-hop industry as far as dancing or whatever the case might be. Because the op music and just the op talk and the op movement, fam, is really killing the community and individuals dying and going to jail with them Ricos, right? Now, I guess something else got in the wind with Big Boogie, fam, you know, because he continued to go to his social media here recently and he spoke out. And this time, fam, when he spoke out, he was pretty much... Uh, direct again on the opposition talk, right? And Big Boogie said, fam, that I don't know why pretty much these dudes keeping his name in his mouth. I don't see him. You know, I don't I don't care about him. You know, uh, none of that. You feel me? Pretty much saying, just keep talking. I'm going to keep doing me. And he keeping it solid in his last life. Like he said, he ain't going to do too much talking. If they pull up on him, fam, you feel me? He going to pop it off, right? Now, we know that. And I got to say that Big Boogie is really not starting these, you know, the beefs, fam, with these individuals, these different rappers. But it's part of the process and it's part of the game, fam, and it come with success. And so individuals be thinking that, hey, I'm finna sign a deal and everything just finna be uh, chill. I'm gonna lay back, get my money, feed my family. I'm not gonna have no problems. It don't work like that, fam, in the hip hop industry. And it's crazy that a lot of individuals is running to that game because they feel like that's all they know. And they want the Scarface image, fam, also that come behind rap. Believe it or not, when you sign a deal, get in these positions. It be hard for a lot of these rappers. That's why Thug in the jam like he is. That's why we seeing rappers uh, get killed and do different things. Um, that street wise, why they got the deal, fam? Because of the stronghold, the Scarface image, the the idolization of people towards the rapper, fam, will cause them to drown. Now, one thing that I can say about Big Boogie, like I was just saying, he ain't initiating none of this beef. But he answering this be fam, when it comes to these individuals speaking on this name. It's kind of hard to wake up and see on social media or whatever the case might be, fans talking about an individual that got a name or whatever the case might be. And he's speaking on your name and he continued to do that, fam. It'd be hard for these dudes that come from the streets not to speak back out, fam, especially the individual that's around them, fam. But I will keep y'all updated on situations. But make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm out.